Nestled in the Atlantic, the Canary Islands are a paradise for millions of tourists each year. But behind the breathtaking landscapes and vibrant tourist spots, there's a growing crisis affecting the residents. Today, we're diving into how your holiday might be harming the very beauty you came to see. In 2023, the Canary Islands welcomed a record-breaking 14.1 million visitors, but this surge in tourism is taking a toll on the island's residents and their resources. Local activists are ringing alarm bells. The islands are hitting a breaking point, with traffic-clogged roads and an ongoing hydraulic emergency due to the strain on water supplies. The response from the community has been one of frustration and protest. Residents are being pushed to the edge, with some even forced to sleep in their cars or caves as housing prices soar. New hotel constructions are meeting fierce opposition, with activists in Tenerife resorting to hunger strikes to voice their protests. The cost of living has skyrocketed, Locals find themselves priced out of their own neighborhoods, overwhelmed by short-term rental platforms like Airbnb and Booking.com, which activists compare to a cancer consuming the island. The economic disparity is stark. Nearly 34% of the local population is at risk of poverty or social exclusion. The influx of tourists isn't just a social issue, it's an environmental crisis too. The islands are struggling under the pressure with significant impacts on health services, waste management, and biodiversity. In an act of defiance, residents have begun to put up signs and even chain off areas to protect their dwindling sanctuaries. As visitors, it's crucial to consider the impact our travels have on local communities. Sustainable tourism isn't just a choice, it's a necessity. We can help preserve the Canary Islands for future generations by choosing responsible travel practices. It's time to rethink tourism to ensure it enriches both visitor and host alike. Overtourism poses significant dangers to destinations affecting both the local community and the environment. It can lead to housing shortages and inflated prices, making living conditions difficult for residents, as seen in areas like the Canary Islands, where locals have been pushed to extreme measures, such as living in cars or caves due to soaring rental costs. Economically, while tourism can be a major source of income, Overtourism can overwhelm local infrastructure, leading to traffic congestion, overloaded public services, and strained resources like water and waste management systems. Environmentally, overtourism can lead to pollution, damage to landscapes, and harm to wildlife as the natural habitats that attract tourists become degraded through excessive use. Socially, the quality of life for residents can deteriorate with cultural landmarks and neighborhoods becoming overcrowded, which can lead to a loss of local identity and heritage. These challenges highlight the need for sustainable tourism practices that balance the economic benefits of tourism with the well-being of local communities and the preservation of natural environments. Join us in making a change. Learn more about how you can help at... Thank you for watching and remember, travel thoughtfully.